What's going on everyone? This is SuperTal3 and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to show you guys how to install the new WinGet package manager. Right now it's still in alpha 0.1 so it's very beta. A lot of features are missing from it but in the future as Microsoft expands on it, it's going to get a whole lot better and I'm really excited about Microsoft's step in the right direction. Now for a long time they've had this one called Chocolatey and it's not official. It's an unofficial Windows package manager and you can use that too and in all honesty it is better than Winget. I'm going to make a video about how to install and use Chocolatey because in the future from what they said at Microsoft Build, Winget is going to be compatible with Chocolatey's repositories which is going to be really great for all involved. But like I said, please give Microsoft some grace on this because Winget is fairly new. But anyways, if all this sounds interesting to you and you want to try out Winget for yourself, let's hop over to the computer. Alright guys, so here we are on my computer and we'll go ahead and head to github.com slash Microsoft slash Winget CLI to download the Winget package manager. As you can see, it says this repository contains the source code for the Windows package manager client, aka Winget. Packages available to the client are in this community repo, which you can check out at this link. And it tells you all the stuff. So yeah, if you're interested in contributing to the repo, feel free to do so. Now, to install it yourself, you're gonna go, we can do it this way. It's distributed within the app install package. So what you'll do is you'll download a Windows 10 Insider build and then you'll join the preview flight ring. So if you put your email in, you should get an email. It looks something like this and it has the link that you go click on. So if you just click on it, it'll open the Microsoft Store and it takes a second to load. You can click install and uh, installs a preview version of the app install, which comes with Winget. So now if we go over here to PowerShell, we type Winget. You can see it automatically displays a short little help summary. Here we would, you can see we can do install and we can do show, source, and search. So we'll just do Winget, search, and it'll list everything and ta-da. So you can see there's a whole bunch of things that we can do. Even Visual Studio you can install, which is pretty cool. Microsoft Teams, that's a good one. So we'll just do this. We'll do when get Microsoft Teams. Uh, okay, so I forgot. So we'll do when get install Microsoft Teams. And it should be installing. So when get pretty much runs this um, it downloads the exe of whatever program and then runs that installer for you. You usually have to click on it or whatever. So I'll just go ahead and pretty much Microsoft Teams is installed. As you can see, it says successfully installed and I'll sign in later. So this is pretty much how you install Winget. It's a very basic package manager right now. Doesn't have a lot of features most package managers have because it is in alpha 0.1. As you can see right here, 0.1 preview. So give it some grace, it's not the best, but it's a step in the right direction for Microsoft. So that's pretty much all we have on the computer. Jump back on the main camera to finish up the video. And there you have it guys. This is how to install the WinGet package manager. Now, like I said multiple times in the video, it is in early alpha version 0.1. So give it some grace. I know it doesn't have the features to uninstall and it's not near as good as the chocolatey package manager, but nonetheless, it's so good step for Microsoft heading in the right direction with things and I hope they continue to develop it and make it a more fully fledged and fully featured package management system. So that's it for today's video guys. Thank you guys for watching. If you like the video please leave a like. Comment down below your thoughts on this new package manager and whether you like the direction Microsoft is heading with software. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already and thank you for watching. This is SuperTal3 signing out.